in the cave. And I just get, I get so angry all again because she didn't deserve it. She didn't ask for this. She didn't ask for this. But the next morning, um, she got out of bed and went down to the kitchen and I heard her scream and I went down to see what was wrong and she had her back turned. <clears throat> and she was crying and I was like, what's wrong, what's, what's wrong? She was like, I can't, I can't. She was just shaking um, furiously, I can't, I can't. And I was like, well, you can't, she's like, I can't look at those stairs. And it was from that point where we realized like she couldn't even be in that house anymore. And how did the harm cause the relationship? It, 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 it is because, you know, there are times where she gets closed off. <sighs> during the sentencing. So they were trying to get, I guess, some sympathy or some shit like that. I don't know. Um, it just pissed me off because they just keep re-traumatizing my goddamn wife with this foolishness. And we've been dealing with this for five years. Five years. And I'm just ready to get behind us. I got all kind of that I could be doing having to sit in court with this foolishness. I just got to let play out. You got to be very careful about making decisions emotionally. You got to stay calm, stay focused, stay prayed up. And stay on your path. You know what I'm saying? Because that's what always happens when, when we get in the way of God trying to make shit happen quicker. And and trying to get in the way of the process. No, you hear everybody say it. But this is what we mean when we say trust the process. That's what this shit means. You got to trust the process. That's the thing, it ain't their recipe, but I, I don't want to get into that either. They, they lying about that, it ain't their recipe. But, you know, people want to lie in court and perjure themselves, that's that's on them. They can do whatever they want to do. It's not a recipe, which is crazy, but it's neither here nor there. We moving on. We moving on. and I shot him. Period. End of story. That's Generation Z, baby. Don't argue with Generation Z. They stand for the zero. What? Wow. No, we don't have turkey, turkey burgers. We got vegan burgers. We don't have turkey burgers, though.